Rory, last game of the Six Nations Championship. Is there a real hunger in camp this week? Um, yeah, look, absolutely. I think it was the win last week. Sort of give us that. I suppose a bit of the monkey off our back to get the win in the championship. And look, we've trained really well, probably since the England game especially. And, uh, you know, I think there's a real hunger and desire to finish this campaign off strong, um, to keep improving and, and to keep getting better at the things that, that we haven't done so well in this championship. And really the stuff that we have done well to see how much better we can be at that as well. The captain's run today and in the true sense uh, the coaches sat out the training session what was that about? Uh, it was just I suppose to change things up a little bit you know it's been a long campaign and um, I think the more you can freshen things up and the more you can change and challenge people the better this is just another another little thing it's sometimes something we do away from home as well we just we've done it here and uh, like it's when you have decision makers like Johnny in there, it's easy, you know, we just sit down and see what we want to do and, and just go through it. And, and like I say, it just it keeps the boys from going into autopilot the day before the game and it gets them, gets them out of bed, I suppose. A few personal milestones for you this Six Nations Championship, but also one tomorrow for Keith Earls winning his 50th cap. Yeah, look, it's, um, you know, Earls, he's a fantastic player. I remember the first time he came into the Ireland squad, the first time we saw him, playing for Munster, going to the Lions as a, as a really, really young kid and, you know, he's a fantastic player and um, it'll be it'll be great to see him coming out and win his 50th cap. He's, he's had his, his fair share of bad luck along the way and uh, hopefully tomorrow will be a great day and a bit of good luck for him. All right, best of luck.